Hello there. It is I. Um. So I feel like every video on Haven, it's just gonna be me updating you on what we've done because it's been a little while since I've recorded on here, since I've done anything on here for video, and I've just been playing Minecraft. Uh, I'm sure you can tell I am not in my house. This is Char's house. This is Fern, the furnace dog. Uh, this is, um, oh, it's the game. Thank you. This is Corn the Corner Dog. This is, I think, Johan was what they named him. Their new roommate. I made this last night. They had a piglin brute's head and a slime head that they wanted to be made into roommate slash roommates. So I did this little thing where, like, what did I say his name was? Johan? That's what they called him. Is like working on his, his stuff. He's working on like his sword and his pickaxe and everything. And he's got a shield with a quiver of arrows. And he's making more arrows. And he has discovered a slime that has somehow slipped its way into the house. Because Char lives, oh man, next to a swamp. So I'm like, yeah, it just, it just um slipped right in. Uh, I'm gonna sleep real quick in... Okay, I'm not gonna sleep real quick. I'm gonna go home. Um, oh, I've also been doing this as a way to, like, prank uh, Char. Um, I've also added a ghost to their house, which is fun. Uh, uh <laughs> Some things have happened. The, this was their pig pen. Uh, it is now full of zombie pigmen because uh, lightning. Lightning happens. Uh, I'm gonna uh, head home, sleep through the night, and then go through and show you what you've missed. The things that have been made since the last video. And then I'm gonna build a shop where I uh, sell my services to make those little statue scenes. Um, like the one where I gave Char a roommate. Um, yeah. One of my projects is right here. This is what I call the keep. It's just like a little, little square area. Oh, <laughs> I forgot I, um, any Achievement Hunter fans in chat? That is the Tower of Pimps. I will not elaborate if you don't know what it is. Uh, <laughs> but that's there. This is the keep. Uh, it's a shitty little castle thing that I wanted to do. It was mostly a way for me to um, just dig up a mountain with my beacon because I wanted to, um, so I did. There used to be a whole other mountain connected to this one. It used to be like a whole thing right here that I destroyed because I needed a flat surface and I've made this. It's just a little place. I haven't really done that much with it. There is one big thing I've done, which I will show you in a minute. Uh, but it's just got these four towers with these... All of these stairs are scuffed as hell. None of them are even. Uh, none of them look the same at all. They're all completely different. Um, and it is infuriating, but, you know, that is just how it is. This- oh, this is my villager, Frumpus. Um, don't ask about the name, it was a whole thing with Char. He sells Efficiency 3 books, and that was the best trade I could get. So I buy, like, what, four of these? Combine two and efficiency four, and then those two efficiency five. So I have efficiency five books. And such things. There's another portal uh, for the nether, clearly. This is my bone box. And I'm about to show you why I needed a bone box. And what most of my beacon digging work was for. Those are all empty now, but foreshadowing. My uh, sister helped me dig this, which is why there's so much cobblestone, because um, she didn't have a, a diamond silk touch pick. <laughs> um, which is actually good. I haven't had cobblestone since like the first like month or so of playing this, so having cobblestone is good. It's a, actually a very useful block. <laughs> this is... um. What I've been doing, what I've done, I built, I dug big hole 
built some pillars and did like half a dragon skeleton. Because I like doing those, but I'm really bad at it. These are all half slabs too, which is why only some of it's lit up. Um, it was slabbed. Um, I'm not great at the skulls. I'm really, I'm not. I'm trying to get better. This is the second dragon I've built. I don't think I ever showed the first one I did. It was named Dacus Bodicus. He was mentioned if you've seen the first episode of the Haven SMP. And if you haven't, I really don't know why you're here. But yeah, it's it's just like um it's just like a rib cage and a tail and a skull and a wing. Because I was gonna do like the whole thing, but I didn't want to work out how to do a wing this way. <laughs> Cause pillars. It was the whole thing. And mobs do still spawn on this, like right there. Because string, which you probably saw when I was climbing up, it was supposed to not make it spawn, but I guess they changed it to so where it only like lowers the rates, which is really annoying. I wanted it to be dark and like spooky, and I put string on all of it, every single flat surface something could spawn on, and then I left and things kept spawning, so I wanted it to be all dark and mysterious, but then I just had to put torches everywhere, so sad about that, but oh, yep. Speak the devil. So today's agenda is I'm gonna show you one more thing and I'm gonna build that shop and there's two little armor statue dudes that I had in our little shopping district that I need to rebuild because they were destroyed. Uh, which apparently they can be destroyed when they're locked in place which I didn't know was a thing so that's fun so I have to go remake that. Uh, this is called the Feast of the Forest King. This is the Forest King. He's dead. Ow! <laughs> uh, is a uh, yeah. Is he's, he's he's dead. So it's like a some sort of forest king, you know, invites people here, and he's just a skeleton. So it's like weird magic stuff. Um, but yeah, I got a little a little thing going on here. So this is the forest king. This is his crown, quote air quote air quote crown. Uh, this is a chicken man who got served chicken. Um, by the, like, the powers that serve stuff here, and he has, like, put his axe to the table and been like, it was you, wasn't it? And, um, you know, like, how dare you, you know, insult me like this, or whatever. And he's like, it wasn't me, sit the fuck down, or try your luck, you know? Uh, he's eating brown dye, because I couldn't think of any other food things to, to that shulkers would want to eat. I don't know what they eat, you know? I don't know what they eat. Um, this is a blaze archer man, if you couldn't tell. He has successfully, like, flicked a coin up in the air and stuck it to the tree. And the two squid bros are like, oh! Like, this one's like, holy shit, he did it! And this one's like, well, I'll fucking drink to that! And, <laughs> yeah. Um, and it's just got little bits and bobs. Like, I imagine they were, like, uh, talking currencies, like, Blaze in the nether. Gold is their main, like, oh, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Gold is their main, like, um, trade with piglins and such. So I was like, maybe the squid and, like, guardians use prismarine. Because those look like a little, it looks like a little pile, pile of coins. I was going to say a puddle of coins, but that doesn't actually make sense. So, <laughs> like a little, little uh, handful of coins, you know, like prismarine shards or prismarine bits was their currency. And they got a little fish for eating. Um... Yeah, so, yeah, that was my whole little dealing with that. But this is the Feast of the Forest King. Um, it's just, I wanted to do a fun little thing in the forest. So I did. Before I do anything, I need armor. Because I have, I got nothing. I'm out. I gotta go end busting again. This chest used to be full of chest plates and pants and boots, but I got nothing now. Now I got nothing. I'm, I'm out. I've been bled dry. I mean, it's, it's, I can't. I already have a sword. There's just nothing I can do. I have to resort to leather and my cow farm is not an automatic cow farm. I have to go down there and manually slaughter the cows and manually breed the cows. I could fix that, but that's a lot of work. <laughs> 
<laughs> so, um, yeah, I have to do that real quick. Uh, I'll be back to you once I have all that done. So this is new. This, this was not here yesterday. Um, this whole... This. <laughs> Alright, um... I was not at all what I expected to find. <laughs> I guess uh, somebody was, uh... Someone was busy yesterday. I was on here last night at like 4 a.m. Very strange. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm just gonna. I was just gonna come check if anything had changed since I'd been here yesterday. Um, at Wings and Things and Potions and Motion, and then find a good place to put down. Uh, what I've decided to call Armor, because I couldn't think of a, a good name for it. I think right here. I'm, I'm thinking just just this little square. Maybe a bit more of a rectangle, maybe wide it out this way. Um, and like, you know. I, it, it's, I want it to be kind of a simple shop. The outside is not the important. Bit. What's important is what's gonna be inside. Is I'm gonna have little statues and stuff all out here on like around the outside. I'll have like stuff around maybe this pond. Uh, I'm gonna fix the dudes by the boards and be like example of simple things I can do. The dudes at the the notice board. I have brought a bed with me because the night time cometh. And cometh it does. This is. My box of props for the things that I'm going to be making. And these are just building materials. I don't know what I'll use or what I'll do, but um, I'm going to piece something together. Somehow. <laughs> and we'll figure it out. Do I know what I'm doing? Of course not. I don't build. I'm not a builder. I don't know what I'm doing. But you know... I'm doing my best, and I think that's what matters. Um, aka, that's how I get away with doing crap like this. <laughs> you know, I'm just doing my best. Uh, okay, I'm gonna move my little operation inside. Um, just so I don't have to keep running around the side of the place. I'll leave the other two boxes in my inventory for now. I don't know what I'm gonna do with the roof. Uh, I did not bring enough door. I don't know why I only brought one. Maybe I was like, no door? I don't know. I really haven't a clue. I'll add those things to the last. I wanna kind of... Mm, I, I have kind of a confusing idea. I want to build up the room, yes, and kind of make it not interactive, but have the whole process of, uh, like, requesting me to build that something kind of ingrained into the armor stands. Like, you gotta go around them and be like, oh, this is where I do the thing. Gotta go, you know, it's the, I, I don't know. It's, I'm, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I have an idea, and it's kind of dumb as hell, but you know, everything I do is kind of dumb as hell. Can I? I can. Okay. Let's just, let's see what we can do here. I don't have enough, but something like that, and then maybe like just all the way across and the natural light coming in and we just put like ingrained torches like uh in my little um scenes and stuff i think that'll be good um i do need to get some sand yeah okay just gonna shave a little off the top of this mountain because i don't need like a ton i just need some um but i did use all of my sand at home to 
get that smooth sandstone. So maybe maybe we'll get a we'll get a little bit more than we need. Take some home, you know. Put it back in our chests, you know. You know we gotta you gotta be ready for stuff. I mean, it's not like the desert is far. Clearly, I'm here already, and I'm already gotten what I need. But I mean, you know. It's better to have- oh, Jesus. It's better to have it and not need it than to need it and to not have it, am I right, ladies? Both of these boys have seen better days. I like stockpile type things where you just have, like, little bitty blocks up on the top. So it's like, wow, you got- you got a lot. Like, damn, you got so much, you don't even know where to put it. There, see? Like, a little bit of a stockpile type thing. I mean, dirt's a bad example, but- <laughs> You know, that's just that's just what we're gonna keep. What is what we're gonna do for now? Um Yeah, I've just been waiting for this. So we can boop. Oh that should be the perfect demand. Uh I forgot I was gonna do this across the whole dang roof. I'm gonna have to go back to that desert. <laughs> F Alright. But for now. Oh. Lovely. Maybe I'll just do like sparse bits with spruce or stone slabs or something. Cause I mean, it's a desert is so much work. I mean, I know I have extra sand, but it's so much work. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll try that out. And if I hate it, then um, we'll just go back to the desert. But for now, I'm gonna do that, and I'll I'll show you what I decide to do for the end result. Is it disgusting? Yes. Do I love it? Kind of. So, um... I'm leaving like that. <laughs> uh, and you know what? You're just gonna have to live with it. Cause, um... Yeah, it's horrible. It's bad. But I like it. Cause I just like the horrible and bad things. But I do love the little gap that I have around all the walls. It's very fun. Um, I was just starting to attempt a little bit of a, a thing here where, like, I don't know, people crafted stuff and whatnot all over the place. Um, yeah, I, I'm really just gonna start on the statues and stuff now, the dioramas, and just go from there, I guess. I have a couple of fun ideas, most of them are pretty simple. Um, but I'm just gonna do them and then come back and show you what I've done. So, yeah. And now I can show you what I've done. Um, we'll start over here with the ones that were there before that were destroyed, my poor lads. <sighs> honestly, I just, honestly, I, I just, I just. I just want to show the people my work. Uh, I guess we'll be doing a raid after this when we go home. Any more? Anyone else? Not that I can hear. All right. As I was saying, um, Char has lost two of their fetch chests, which they lost them a while ago. They just put them down somewhere and then they forget them and then they don't know where they are. So I had a kind of thing of like these two are rocking up and being like, oh hey look, someone's missing something. Maybe we should go look for them. And being like, oh yeah, yeah. Just kind of, just to bring a little bit of life to be like, oh hey look, a notice. You know, and he's got a sword, he's got a shovel and a pick. So, you know, just like people. And I have a thing over here that I was going to do more with, but doing this sucks. <laughs> and I have, throughout the whole the whole shop, I have little, like, um, advertisement things. So this one is Cosmic Horrors Add a Touch of Terror to Any Cave or Crevice. And this is some sort of horrible, noodly spider creature coming out of the shadows. And this guy hasn't really realized that it's there yet. He's, like, coming to look at a disturbance and or like destroy this little cave that has formed and he about a he about to have a bad time sorry buddy um inside 
close that because there was a creeper incident, which is why there's sand there now instead of smooth sandstone, and why we have spruce doors instead of the one birch door that I was gonna go get another one of. This is just storage, and because I couldn't think of anything to do in this corner. Maybe I'll add something later on, but for now, this is what we got. So you walk right in, and a fight scene, a fan favorite of all, just like. I didn't bring another sword with me, so I used a pickaxe, <laughs> but these two were just kind of going at it. He was like, coming down with the pick, he's blocking it with his sword, you know, you know. This is prized armor, looks great on display, so I have like a, like a head down holding the sword, or like, salute with the sword, you know, kind of deal, because, you know, people like different stuff. Uh, this is nothing specific. Stockpiles are an easy way to fill empty space, you know, stockpile. He's getting some dirt. He's being like, that's not what I need. Making arrows. Um, and yeah, that's kind of it. Oh, and light glitches are often unavoidable. This, you can't see it if you have like a torch in your hand with the Optifine glow, but without it, it's just, it's just bad. So I left that there just, just cause you know, sometimes it won't be perfect. And we have a little information book. Which, um, I'm not gonna read the whole thing to you, but it's pretty much this place is called Armor. Armorier, or whatever the hell it's called. <laughs> and it's, you know, pretty much just, I can make statues, examples are around the place. Um, to do, to place an order, grab a piece of paper, put your name on it with the anvil, put it in the chest. And then that will, um, let me know that you want to have a meeting and that I need to contact you through Discord or in Minecraft some other way uh, and I'll just meet up with whoever wants whoever wants something from me and we just go from there. They'll like show me where they want me to put the stuff and like what it is and give me any props they specifically want. Uh, they do get discounts if they give me like the armor and the weapons and the props and the armor stands. Um, and the price will be calculated afterward, depending on how, um, complicated, that's the word I was thinking of, how complicated the thing they want me to make is. Like, so this thing out here, which I didn't even finish, would be expensive. A horrible little monstrosity, because these are all individual little <laughs> tiny armor stands, and it, you know, I'll get better at it. And I'll do bigger stuff in the future, but for now, it takes me so long because I'm still, I'm still learning. I'm still getting good at it. People are what I'm good at. Little dudes, little little guys in the place. And I've, you know, in the examples, I'm like there are places also thing out of the side of chars in my house, in the forest, on Will's bridge, just kind of all over the place because I like to put them all over the place. Uh, but yeah, that's kind of it. We got a new little shop. Um. And I guess that's kind of all I wanted to do on here today. Uh, yeah. That's it, I think. <laughs> um, yeah. Hopefully next time this whole deal will be dealt with. Maybe I'll ask Char if they want some help. But, I don't know. Uh, but that's all I got. That's all I'm gonna do. Uh, hopefully there'll be a new episode up eventually. God knows when, honestly. But I mean, you never know. I hope you all enjoyed as much as I did the episode. I know it was pretty uneventful. Um, but that's kind of Minecraft when you're not playing PvP. And I probably never will because I'm really bad at it. And I'm too lazy to get good at it. Yeah. That's kind of it. Uh, goodbye. Oh god, it's lagging. Oh god. Oh god, this is a terrible time for it to lag. Oh no. My villagers. <laughs> Remove the button. Take it off. Eh, okay. Eh. Try to get in my house. You are in my house? I missed. One down. I don't know if it's lagging this bad for you guys, but I can't see anything. <laughs> it just makes it spicy. It's a spicy raid. Hey ya! Ah, huh. oh, there they are, coming from the trees. Dun, 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 dun. Thank you. 
Goodbye. Goodbye. Hey, boys. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they pick up the banner if it. If, oh, well, I didn't know that was a thing. Okay. Oh, hey there. Hey, boys. I missed. Where's your big beastie? Ooh. Pillager head. Don't mind if I do. Well, the Ravager's the only one left, but I don't know where it is. Oh, there it is. Hey, big beastie. Yeah. <gasps> yes! Ravager head! Raid victory. Sweet, that means I should do some trading. I'm stuck under the trees. 